Good morning children today let us to begin a lesson from geography that is industries secondary activity or manufacturing change raw materials into products of value to the people industry is one such a secondary activity producing materials that people can meet their needs fulfill their needs that is happened in industries so industry we can consider it as a secondary activity industry refers to an activity that is concerned with the production of goods extraction of minerals or the provision of services thus we have iron and steel industry coal mining industry and tourism industry classification of industries we have classified industries on the basis of raw material that they use size and ownership let us to see one by one now the first one is raw material industries may be agro based mineral based marine based and forest based now among them the first one is agro based industries these industries use plant and animal based products as their raw material like food processing vegetable oil cotton textile dairy products and leather industries mineral based industries are primary industries which use mineral ores as their raw materials like iron ore gold diamond marine based industries use products from the sea and oceans as raw materials like processing seafood fish oil these are forest based industries utilize forest produce as a raw material like pulp and paper pharmaceuticals furniture and buildings now the next one is size it refers to the amount of capital capital in the sense amount invested in the industry number of people employed and the volume of production it can be classified into small scale and large scale industries now first one is small scale industries it is also called as cottage or household industries these are a type of small scale industry where the products are manufactured by hand by the artisans like basket weaving pottery silk weaving food processing making of candles incense stick these all these small scale industries use lesser amount of capital and technology the investment of money will be less along with that even they use less technology too now the next one is large scale industries they produce large volume of products investment of capital will be higher and technology used is superior for example is production of automobiles and heavy machineries next one is about ownership it is classified into private sector state owned or public sector joint sector and cooperative sector private sector industries these are owned by individual or a group of individuals like granite reliance industries limited infosys technologies like these state owned or public sector industries are owned as well as operated by the government such as hindustan aeronautics limited hal steel authority of india limited sail karnataka milk federation these are some examples now joint sector industries these are owned and operated by the state and individuals or a group of individuals so like maruti udyoga limited is a best example for this next one is cooperative sector industries these are owned and operated by the producers or suppliers of raw materials 
workers or some of the terms both together like Anand Milk Union Limited and Sudha Dairy. Okay children, let us to continue in second part. Good day children.